Hey, what's going on, CoinOut TV subscribers? Robert Walkman here. I want to do a review of Executioners from Shaolin, a 1977 Shaw Brothers classic martial arts kung fu film from director Long Kar Lai. This uh, appeared in the Shaw Scope Volume 1 set that's uh, now is a couple years old. You get this for about $100. I would recommend picking it up. It's got a great collection of movies in there worth uh, checking it out. So I watched it. Recently on the Shaw Scope Volume 1, um, and uh, I've, I've seen it many a times before. Let me get to the synopsis, let me get to some of my notes, and then I'll give you my letter grade uh, towards the end of this video and my, and my recap and stuff. So IMDb uh, says, uh, Hong Se Kwan devotes years to mastering tiger-style kung fu in order to defeat the evil pri priest Pai Mei, his wife, who is an expert in crane style kung fu, has a feeling training in only one style won't be enough. So there's a, there's a good, uh, that's a good recap there, good synopsis uh, that gives you a good idea of the dynamics of this movie. There's a lot going on to this movie. It's very enjoyable. So we got starring uh, Chen Quan Tai as Hung Se Kwong and Lo Li as the white browed Pete Priest. Pai Mei, uh, I think this is like one of his iconic roles as far as villain goes, uh, with cameo, of course, by Gordon Liu in the opening fight scene. Uh, the bulk of the movie spans the uh, years of the relationship between uh, Chen Quan Tai and his wife and their young boy. There's uh, lots of silly sparring going on between the father and the son with the occasional attacks on priest Pai Mei, who is a formidable opponent uh, just just intimidating formal. He, he knows he's badass and uh, he flaunts it and, and taunts people. It's funny to see uh, Pai Mei's trademark, trademark move in action a few times where he sort of traps someone's foot in his groin area and then finishes them off. There's some funny sound effects uh, there and uh, just, just that alone is very memorable. If you've seen this movie before, you know, he kind of like drags the person back. The foot gets caught in his crotch area there, which I, I guess he doesn't have anything. It's a, it's a mystery. It's void. He's supposed to be a eunuch, I believe. So, um, and then he kind of finishes people off. And um, that, that's just like a silly kind of like um, iconic-y. You know, I hate to keep using the word iconic. But if you've seen this movie before, you remember that. Uh, the rest of the cast, we got Lily Lee has a large role in the movie as uh, Chen's wife. So she's the one that knows crane style. He knows tiger style. She believes, hey, you know, listen to me. We'll, uh, we'll combine forces and uh, this will be able to help. And uh, Chen is like um, headstrong, stubborn. He's, uh, you know, he's a hard worker and he's got this training dummy and he's been practicing and trying to like, you know, seek out his revenge and get rid of the priest Pai Mei. But, um, you know, spoilers here, uh, you know, ultimately he's pretty unsuccessful with things. Um, their son is played by Wang Yi, who's been in a handful of movies here and there. He's kind of a kind of a comedic relief in other movies I've seen him in, and this in this movie's kind of like light and fun. He kind of um, teases his dad, jumps on him on his shoulders, and does a little crane technique where the the legs are very strong, and then kind of grasp onto somebody's head and neck and makes it difficult for them to flip him off. Um, so, and then it sort of turns out that when um, Hong Se Kwai is unsuccessful in defeating uh, Pai Mei, that it's Wang Yu's character, a son, who actually is the one to defeat, defeat Pai Mei uh, using a combination of the tiger crane style. Um, so there's, uh, there's a lot to learn with this movie going in. Uh, symbolism, uh, family, code of honor, um, revenge. I uh, would have liked to have seen a, lot, a bigger part for Gordon Liu in this, but this was when he was kind of still like a bit player, didn't turn into a star yet, so you get kind of a, a small role um, with him in the movie. So I'm going to give this movie a grade of a B-. I enjoyed it. It's got some fun moments. It's rewatchable, above average. Um, now, when it comes to the Shaw Scope Blu-ray here, I was uh, checking out the description of the disc. I didn't see commentary on there. This is paired with uh, Challenge of the Masters, another great Shaw Brothers movie. Uh, so it's, we got 2K restoration, high definition, uh, Mandarin and English, uh, new subs. There's a, uh, Tony Raines does a little interview on here. There's some uh, archival interviews of Gordon Liu and uh, Chen Quan Tai. And let's see, alternate English credits for execution as a Shaolin. 
and some trailers and image galleries for both films. Didn't see commentary on either either that or Challenge of the Masters. That would have been nice. So uh, again, if you haven't picked up, if you're a fan of Shaw Brothers movies and you haven't picked up Shaw Scope, um, volume one or two, those great two great collections worth checking out. Let me know what your thoughts are on Executioners uh, from Shaolin, 1977, one of the early Long Kar Lung um, directing movies. Uh, that's it for this video. If you're brand new, please subscribe and hit that thumbs up. It'll help the uh, channel and my videos for CoinOp TV. We'll see you next time.